Shortly after 8 a.m., our suspect was captured. I want to say, first and foremost, thank God there were no injuries to law enforcement or to the public. We obviously became deeply concerned after the suspect was able to steal a weapon. He was apprehended this morning with no shots fired. There was uh, an aircraft overhead utilizing uh, FLIR technology and uh, close to 1 a.m. picked up a heat signal that they began to track it was west of PA 100 and north of Prizer Road. Tactical teams began to converge on that location where the heat source was moving and shortly after 8 a.m. tactical teams converged on the area where the uh, heat source was. They were able to move in very quietly. They had the element of surprise. Cavalcante did not realize he was surrounded until that had occurred. That did not stop him from trying to escape. He began to crawl through thick underbrush, taking his rifle with him as he went. One of the Customs and Border Control teams, BORTAC, uh, had a dog with them. They released the dog. Some of our PSP CERT members were also there, had him surrounded. The dog sub subdued him, and team members from both of those teams immediately moved in. He continued to resist, but was uh, forcibly taken into custody. No one was injured as a result of that. Excuse me. He did sustain uh, a minor bite wound. Uh, we had uh, medical uh, personnel at the scene and they, uh, they took a look at that. Uh, there were people who were intent and intended to assist him. We had been successful, uh, to the best of my knowledge, we had been successful in preventing that assistance from reaching him. We'll be discussing with the district attorney what, if any, charges uh, will be filed. But uh, for right now, again, there is a commitment and he is going to begin serving his life sentence at a state correctional institution. One of the first calls we made upon learning about this capture was to the Brandau family, who, as you can imagine, had been living in a complete nightmare. They are so grateful to the men and women who helped with this capture. They can now finally sleep again.